What is an ulf? An ulf is a unit used to measure air pollution strength emitted from a source. It measures the scent emission of an object, animal or person. The term ulf comes from the Latin word olfactus, which means smelled. One ulf unit represents what an average human emits while at rest. Specifically, someone with a surface area of 1.8 meters squared takes about 0.7 baths a day, works in an office, doesn't smoke, and enjoys good health. People and objects with high emission levels are more likely to be sources of pollution. While a sitting non-smoker emits about one ulf, their smoking counterparts emit 25 ulf and an athlete 30. Non-smoking couch potatoes pollute less than athletes and smokers. Marble, linoleum, synthetic fibre and rubber gaskets have varying levels of ulf. The subsequent air quality is measured in decipoles or dp. Remember, ulf is what we emit, while decipoles are what we sense, specifically what we sense with our noses. Professor Pavel Ole Fanger from Denmark coined the term ulf and decipol. He was an expert in thermal comfort and perfecting indoor environments. He was a senior professor at the International Centre for Indoor Environment and Energy at the Technical University of Denmark. Professor Fanger's research showed that poor indoor air quality can cause asthma in children. He also showed that productivity suffers when the air quality in the workplace is poor. Productivity refers to how much one unit of output produces over a given time, that is, output per worker, per day, per week, per month, etc. The word ulf is both singular and plural, like the words sheep and aircraft. We say one sheep, two sheep, one aircraft, two aircraft. We never say two aircrafts or sheeps. We say one ulf, two ulf. We never say two ulfs. In the world of computer files, dot ulf stands for open learning format. According to myviewboard.com, an ulf file is an open standard file format that allows users to easily work with their files on any device or digital whiteboarding software.